everyone, Toby here from TH Guitarist. We're gonna have a look at a quick concept, pretty simple, but pretty cool. Based around pentatonic scale, you can use it for any scale you want, but pentatonic, why not? If you're a beginner and you only know the pentatonic scale, this will be perfect. I'm just gonna do it in E. Um, the idea, you've got the, the five note scale, and the concept is either play a little line um, and then you're just going to move the note up or down a fret, or a note within the line, up or down a fret. So for instance, if I have... something like that. Maybe I'll move the la this note up here, the higher note. So all I'm doing is exploring different notes, rather than being stuck in this box of the pentatonic scale, you just start to explore. You'll find weird notes that you might might think sound crap, but context is everything. No matter what note you play, you can make it work. That's that's what happens, you know? Think jazz dudes, they may make any note work. So let's say for instance, I'm gonna turn on this uh, loop. Turn that up. up. All right, here we go. from this note, instead of going to the, the note within the scale, went up one fret. If I land on it and finish on it, meh, maybe it doesn't sound that good. But if I, I think, all right, well, that's got a lot of tension, so I don't want to stay on that note for too long. I landed on this note, which was behind this one. So essentially, that's going backwards. You can go up a fret as well, just to explore it. And what you end up, eventually, what you're doing is you're, you're just playing other scales or modes or whatever you want to call it. That sounds terrible, but I can use it in a chromatic context. That sounded fine. If I play it like that, it sounds terrible because that's a major third and the chord I'm playing on is a minor. Alright, so that's the concept. Go up or down a fret. If you're going, uh, let's say, tension, super tension. But listen to it. Don't, listen, don't hit a weird note that you're not used to and go, Ugh, and don't play it. Look at it. Know where it is. Know what it sounds like and think, alright, well, you like it or you don't like it, eventually you might love it. But if I play now, pentatonic scale and I'm going to use that note. All right, let's give it a shot. So I'm doing... I'm turning into a jazz guitarist. Anyway, <laughs> simple idea. Move up and down a fret. If you want to understand the, um, the scales, that's another thing. This is not based on knowing your theory. This is just a concept to get you away from just playing pentatonic. And eventually you might go, oh, well, I like that note, I like that note. And fair enough, it may actually end up being the Aeolian scale or the Dorian scale. So this is just, that's it, that's the concept. I'm not gonna babble on anymore, that's it, done. If you wanna learn more about this stuff, feel free to hit me up for lessons. I do Skype lessons, um, so yeah, if you don't live in Lyon, France, give me a Skype, give me a, hit me up for a Skype lesson. All right, cool, take it easy. Cheers, see ya.